On this one take, we're talking about the Dulens APO Mini Primes with the Iviscope 1.5X anamorphic front adapters. So we have got scopes on each one of these lenses. So it makes it really easy on set to just change a lens like anything else. The really nice thing about this is you have a really nice and compact 1.5X anamorphic lens set consisting of a 43, 58, and an 85 that are all T2.4 and they cover Super 35 with the scope. If you want to shoot these as regular primes, you can take the scopes off and they will cover full Vista Vision. Uh, the really nice thing about these lenses is they weigh literally nothing. They can't be more than four inches tall and weigh more than a half a pound a piece. So if you're really looking for a lightweight, travelable package, uh, these lenses are fantastic. Not only that, they have a really great vintage look for them. Uh, nice washout on off-axis light. You get these really interesting streaky rainbow flares that are kind of similar to the unique optics in my opinion. Um, but you get these really nice warm orbital flares that come through frame as well. But they do maintain a great contrast throughout the range. So, you know, shooting interviews, faces, anything you want with these I think would be really great, whether you're shooting spherical or anamorphic. But if you are shooting these in anamorphic and you're using the 1.5X scopes, you'll notice these perform a little bit like the uh, Koa 2X uh, anamorphics that a lot of us are familiar with. Get a nice, beautiful oval bokeh, even at 1.5 on the anamorphic squeeze, but get this like really pleasing anamorphic distortion around the edges, center sharpness is great. Uh, really creates a painterly image, especially the more close focus you get. Things like leaves and textural backgrounds look fantastic. So whether you're shooting these in anamorphic or spherical, you can use them on just about anything your heart chooses. The only downside at the moment, the widest that there is, and we don't have it yet, is a 31. So if you are shooting 35, 31 might be a little bit tight. If you're using this as a spherical only, shooting 31, might be okay for you, uh, but three lenses, all anamorphic, 300 bucks a day. Get a great vintage looking 1.5X anamorphic setup for a very affordable price. Really hard to do that any other way, and these perform great. Note, when you do want to use the 1.5X anamorphics, you need to set your focus to infinity and just leave it there, and then you use the front as your focus mechanism, and that is all you need to worry about. So with that, the do lens, APO mini primes with the anamorphic fronts or without shooting spherical, great set of lenses, can't go wrong.